if your PC isn't fast. Don't worry, I got you covered. Don't skip ahead and follow every step with me. In this video I'm going to show you 10 powerful ways to speed up your Windows 11 PC. So you'll never have to worry about your system being slow again. Alright step 1. Let's tackle those sneaky little apps that sneak in the background. Go to settings. Apps. Startup. We're going to clean all that up so your system can breathe and boot up faster than ever. Alright, now go ahead and turn off anything you don't need or won't be using. They actually run in the background and silently eat up your RAM and CPU. You know stuff like Spotify auto-starting, Teams launching without asking, or OneDrive constantly syncing. They seem harmless, but trust me, they make your PC feel like it's dragging its feet. Step 2. We're going to dig out all that junk hiding in your PC. Go to Start and search Disk Cleanup. Now select your Windows C drive and hit OK. Alright, here it's showing some of the files, but it's not the full list. We need to see all of them. Now click this option to show all the extra files. I've already deleted the big files, but you can go ahead and remove whichever ones you want. Clearing out all those junk files and temporary data that are just slowing things down. Next, it frees up space on your hard drive, so you finally have room for all those memes, videos, and projects you've been hoarding. And the best part, it's super easy. Just a few clicks, and your system feels fresh, clean, and faster than ever. Trust me, your computer will thank you. Disable unnecessary services for better performance. Press Win and R in your keyboard. And type services.msc and click OK. Now go ahead and locate the sysmain service and disable it. And if you're not using a printer, you can totally disable it. Just go find the print spooler service and shut it down. You can disable any service you don't really use. That way your system won't waste resources on random stuff running in the background. The best thing about disabling unnecessary services is how much smoother your PC feels. It boots faster, runs lighter, and you'll actually notice your CPU and RAM breathing easier. Optimize power settings to high performance. Go to Control Panel. and go to Hardware and Sound, and then go to Power Options. By default, Windows sets your power plan to balanced, but you gotta change that if you want maximum performance. Now switch to high performance mode, and now your system's gonna feel 200% faster. Trust me, you'll notice the difference instantly. Enable all CPU cores and maximum RAM. Press Win and R in your keyboard. Type msconfig. Now go to the Boot tab, then click on Advanced Options. From here, select all your CPU cores, and in the next section, set your RAM to the maximum value available. And then just restart your system to feel the difference. Bro, no one's ever told you this before. If you've made it this far, my friend, your system is now way more powerful than before. So hit that like button and subscribe, so I can take a little break too. Disable transparency and visual effects. Go to settings. Accessibility and visual effects. Now turn this options off. And now all those extra Windows animations are gone. Your system can finally breathe easy again. Adjust virtual memory. In start menu search advanced system settings. This helps you use your hard drive space for your RAM, which can have a huge impact on your system's performance. Now go to the Advanced tab, and under Performance, hit that Settings button. Now, click on the Advanced tab again, and under Virtual Memory, hit that Change button, 
Alright, now pick the drive you want to use for your extra RAM space, type in the amount you want. Then hit set and click OK. After that, just restart your system. Update your Windows and graphic driver. Go to setting and Windows update. Guys, you won't believe this. But so many people still don't realize how updating Windows and their graphics drivers can literally transform their PC. Right here, you can just hit check for updates. And Windows will find, download, and install everything for you. All right. Now let's talk about updating your graphics card driver. It's super easy. I'm going to show you how to do it with AMD right here. On the Home tab, at the top right, you'll see your current driver version. And right below that, there's a Check for Updates button. Just click it, and it'll find, download, and install the latest drivers for you. Guys, sometimes the simplest things make the biggest difference. Like those small tricks that can completely transform your system. You can also watch the video that pops up at the top. It's full of simple but super useful tips you've gotta see. Hey buddy, hit that like button to support me. Disable Windows notifications. Probably won't believe this, but having notifications on can actually put a huge strain on your system. Go to Settings, then head over to the System tab. And after that, click on Notifications. Now you can either turn off all notifications completely, or manage them app by app but I'd recommend just disabling them entirely or turning on do not disturb mode. Defragment and optimize drives for HDD only. Now go to the start menu and search for this phrase, defragment and optimize drives. Now select your drive and hit analyze and then optimize. Doing this helps your system read files faster and makes your PC run much smoother. Alright that's it my friend. Don't forget to subscribe for weekly tips to make your PC experience even better.